out with my son today doing some very simple off-road riding getting him used to riding the enduro trying to get him set up on the enduro so he can go on whatever terrain we have This is a nice area called Reach 11 by the 101 and 51. Or I'm sorry, 101 and Tatum. Nice stretch, I think it's about 11 miles one way. You can do about 20 mile loop around the whole thing, take you over to Cave Creek Road and Deer Valley, all the way up to Scottsdale Road. You have to put your trike over a barrier though, you have to actually lift it, there's no way to get it in. Uh, it's a horse barrier. Not a big deal though. Zoom in a few minutes. GoPro stop video. Lots of sand back there. Oh, my legs are tired from the Pemberton Trail yesterday. My body does not want to do this. What's that? I've had enough rest to be good for this, but... GoPro stopped got my son on the Scorpion Road model that we outfitted for off-road use. No rack, body link seat. Keep it as light as we can. It took some doing, but got a two inch two and a half inch tire on the back which is great for going up steep hills it's a very nice ride trails are great come out here during the week not a lot of people here nicely done and if you come out here in the summer say 110 degrees it's usually about 20 degrees cooler back here because of all the trees and plants out here great place off-road in the summer you can see lots of wildlife out here as well lots of rattlesnakes too cold for them right now, but you gotta really watch out for them. Or, or 
head toward Scottsdale Road now. Bike up. Now we're headed towards Scottsdale Road, heading east. GoPro stop video. Eric's rolling with an air shock, which absolutely is better for this type of riding versus the spring I've got on this one. The spring was on this one, and then I swapped it for the one on that track because I used that one for the real rough stuff. And it's pretty amazing when I put these trikes through only damaged one once out here and it was certainly my fault this is a great place to just come out and see if this is the kind of ride you want to do definitely recommend full suspension out here although I rode a hard cat trike without suspension out here for many many years and no problem other than feeling it on your back a lot more than this cushion suspension stuff like riding on butter these eight feet scorpions are, just have amazing suspension compared to other trikes i've ridden quite a few and nothing quite like these gopro stop video we'll go ahead now uh, Eric's back on the Enduro. Got a little trouble to change on this one, but seems to be fine now. Taking the Enduro camping, loaded it up with tents and all my camping gear and went out and camped on it. The rack makes it a lot nicer for carrying lots of stuff. Scorpion I'm riding now has no rack, so very limited uh, luggage space. Stop video. GoPro stop video. Gets a little rough back here. Be ready for easy gear. Uh, they fixed a lot of that. That's nice. GoPro stop yeah, I don't know how the trail is, so be careful. Thank you. Walkers. 
horses always have priority so if you have to pull over for people do it this trail is plenty wide hello lots of fun have a great day GoPro stop video up on the right here these weird little tubes are all burrowing owl habitat where the little owls live and breed you can see them off in the distance there too don't see the owls much usually if you're out here at night all right I just made the loop back from Scottsdale Road going back under what I believe is 56th Street and then we're gonna go find the pond which is a pretty little place full of lots of frogs and always lots of rattlesnakes and occasionally some toads no problem yep Horse trap. Go right, but be very aware of other bikers. It gets a little more narrow back here. And we'll head over to the little pond. a great place to do night riding although not super fun by yourself but there's a mountain bike group that meets out here and rides at night and now I can get my son with me out here it'll be great all right GoPro stop video Here, take a little break by the water. Such a pretty area. Yeah, the bobcat lives back here somewhere. Here we go. Just a wee little pond. Oh, it's got ducks today. GoPro stop video. Now we'll head back to the van. Really cool, it's just a few miles from my house.